Welcome to Drawn in 60 Seconds, where I give you a rapid run-through of a topic in history. Today I'm going to take you through the US Cold War policy of containment. Even before the Grand Alliance collapsed and the Cold War began, the US was concerned at the threat posed by the spreading of communism around the globe. The destruction of World War II had created conditions that, according to the US, were a perfect breeding ground for communism. The Long Telegram, as well as Stalin's takeover of Eastern Europe, persuaded Washington that spreading communism was a direct threat to America's existence, as well as the existence of all democracies, and therefore had to be stopped. Consequently, the US set about attempting to contain communism to those areas it already existed by surrounding it with strong non-communist states through a mix of financial aid, as seen in the Marshall Plan, strategic partnerships, as seen with NATO and CETO, and war, as seen in Vietnam and Korea. Ultimately, though the Soviet Union collapsed and the Cold War was won by the US, the policy of containment, which dominated US foreign policy for the entirety of the Cold War, had very mixed success and often led to tragic outcomes. Hello there, this is Elliot. I hope you enjoyed Drawn in 60 Seconds. If you did, please like and subscribe. And if you have any topic in history you would like me to animate for you, please drop me a comment below.